In this video, I'm going to use a tool called SiteLiner to look for on-site duplicate content. Now, what that means is that I'm looking for content that exists at multiple URLs. And that's a bad thing because Google uh, can sometimes get confused as to which page you want to rank. Um, it can also result in people linking to the wrong page. Now, lots of times, uh, duplicate on-site duplicate content is a result of um, your website software, your content management system. Modern software such as WordPress typically addresses this problem quite well, but there are some older systems that really struggle with it. So in this case here, I'm just going to put in the URL of an e-commerce website and click go. And SiteLiner is going to go away and uh, scan the site and come back with a report outlining a range of things. But the one part of the site uh, analysis that we're going to be interested in is the duplicate content analysis. So what I might do is just press pause here and come back when the analysis is uh, complete. All right, so the report is complete now and you can see that it is scanned 84 pages on the website and this top issue section here tells you what the problems are with the site. And you can see that the first thing is a large amount of duplicate content was found. And if you come down here, you can see your duplicate content and it will tell you that it assesses that 27% of the site's pages are duplicate content. So if we click on the duplicate content link, uh, let's have a better look at what the uh, URLs are. So in this case here, you can see these are all of the product pages, or the majority are product pages and category pages. And you can see that it's made an assessment of the matched words and the percentage of replicated words across the site. So um, it's telling you that these pages are very similar. They are similar enough that it would be considered duplicate. So um, at this point here, it's really... Um, you have to make an assessment as to what to do next. And in this case here, I could um, I could go away and rewrite my product description so that there is minimal duplication of content. Uh, and that would allow each of these product pages to be more unique. Now, you really need to try to use your professional opinion or the opinion of an expert to help you assess uh, whether this is a real problem. But um, as a guide, this is telling me that, hey, this tool is assessing that the content on these product pages is just a little too similar. So going forward, um, I should either rewrite many of these product descriptions or um, be conscious that writing product descriptions going forward, I should be more unique. And that's it. That's how you use SiteLiner to make an assessment of duplicate content.